So when I click on this donation button here, it will allow you to put in five or ten dollars or whatever you want to put. This is more of an updated video of a video I made in the past showing you how to set up your donation buttons on Twitch. A21 what is going on everyone? A21 Aaron is back in the new studio. I want to clear up some confusion that was in the last video. If you are streaming to Twitch, no matter which device you are streaming on, this will work. If you are streaming from your PlayStation phone, Xbox, PC, Nintendo Switch, GameCube, it doesn't really matter. As long as you are streaming onto Twitch, this method will work. I am going to show you how to set this up using a phone. Ever since the pandemic started, everyone and their mamas wants to become streamers. But can you blame them? Not really. Because right Right now is an amazing opportunity to not only get discovered but to make a little extra buck or two and it is a well-known myth that once you start streaming you can start making money or getting donations and people ask how do they get their donations or why they're not receiving donations and it's because you don't have a account set up yet it usually includes using using some kind of a third-party app for this video we are gonna be using Streamlabs, and everything that you need for this video is going to be a Streamlabs account a PayPal account and a Twitch account. If you do not have a Twitch account, that's okay because I actually have a bunch of content on my YouTube channel showing you how to get started on streaming on Twitch. The first thing we're going to talk about is PayPal. And you need PayPal in order to turn the money that you receive from donations into actual spendable money that you can use transferring it into your bank or to use it online or whatever. I'm not really going to tell you how to use money. I'm pretty sure you're familiar with how money works. I would like to answer a few questions that I've gotten in the last video. Like, should I have a personal or business account? And how old do you have to be? Can you have one if you're under 18? So for the first thing, a business and personal account, they're pretty similar. Same fees. Everything's the same. A business account is a little bit more anonymous and it hides your real name and your email address. A personal account is just more for sending, receiving money and stuff like that. If you become a successful streamer and you want to set up a merch shop, then you are going to have to eventually make a business account anyways so that you can start selling or accepting money and sending invoices and stuff like that. So I say just accept the fact that you are gonna become a successful streamer. That way you don't ever have to backtrack. The next thing is, do you have to be 18 years or older in order to have a PayPal? Yes, you do. You have to be 18 years or older in the United States in order to have a PayPal account. But if you are under the age of 18, then I do recommend just asking your parents if they can help you set up a account. It's pretty simple and easy to do. The first thing you're gonna need to do is go to paypal.com and then you're gonna go ahead and sign up if you don't already have one. I recommend signing up for a business account. Like I said, it's just a lot better. Then you're gonna do da 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 and then at gmail.com. And then for your name is gonna be da 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 da. Your legal name is da 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 da. And then for your legal business name, I would recommend using your Twitch or YouTube account name. Then you're gonna put in your phone number and then you'll put in your home address. When you get to this part right here where it says describe business type, you are gonna press individual or sole proprietor. And then you're gonna put a entertainment right here, motion theater, that's what I just normally put. I just put up to here. The website is optional. You could put your Twitch account if you want. And then the MasterCard, if you do start making a lot of money, they will send you a free debit card. Your social. Then for your birthday and then your address or whatever, and then you're gonna press submit. That's pretty much it. It's pretty simple and easy to do to set up a PayPal account. And now you have an active PayPal account and it's pretty much the same thing on your phone as well. So I, I just showed you how to do it on your computer just because it makes it a little bit easier to show. Streamlabs is a third party app that makes the donations look cool. They're the ones who has the alerts, the sounds, the notifications and all that really cool stuff that you see from popular streamers. We're gonna go ahead and go on our phone and set up everything using our phone, go to streamlabs.com. Then you're gonna go ahead and go to log in. And then when you're at the login menu, you're gonna log in to your Twitch or YouTube account, whichever you are gonna be streaming on that you wanna start making money off of. And once you are in Streamlabs, you're gonna go to settings. And then where it says PayPal, you are going to click on PayPal, connect to PayPal. So now I'm logging into my PayPal account through Streamlabs. All right, so now it says allow PayPal to connect to your Streamlabs account. You're gonna go ahead and press agree and connect. Describe your business. So I'm gonna go ahead and just put in my YouTube name, which is A21 Aaron. And then what is the service that you sell? You can either put entertainment. I just put hobbies for this one and then up to $5,000. And then for your customer service email, it's kind of like a burner email because it doesn't really connect to anything that's really important. And then I also have a burner phone number as well that I have using Google numbers just in case. Then we're gonna press connect. And then for the address and everything, you're gonna wanna put your real information because that's where your debit card will be sent. 
or any of the information for legal purposes and especially for taxes. If you start making a lot of money through donations, you're going to have to start doing taxes and you're going to want to make sure that everything is 100% legit on your PayPal account. So now we're going to go back to Streamlabs. And then right here in the yellow bar, it says this is your URL to tip page where viewers can send you donations. So you're going to go ahead and hold down and copy. So now we have copied this URL link right here. This is our tip page for our donations using Streamlabs. We're finally on one of the last two steps, which is going to twitch.tv. So we're going to go ahead and go on our phone, type in twitch.tv. And as you can see, we are in the mobile version, which this will not work because it does not have the options that we need in order to proceed. Instead of holding down the refresh button like you used to do in the old video, now where it says the little A and then the big A, you're going to give that a click. Then it says request desktop website. You're going to go ahead and give that a click. And now we are in the desktop mode. So you are seeing everything on your phone like as if it was on a computer or a laptop. The next thing is go over and scroll in so you can see your little image right here. Give that a click and then you're going to go ahead and go to channel. And the next thing you're going to do is go to the about section. If they click onto your video, they're going to see this about section. And once you get into there, you're going to go ahead and press edit panel, which looks like this. So give that a click and then scroll down just a little bit and you'll see this little gray box with a little plus sign in it. Give that a little tap and then it says add a text or image panel right here where it says panel title. We're going to go ahead and just type in tips because I think it sounds a lot better than donations. The next thing is we're going to go to image links to then you're going to paste the website link that you got from Streamlabs. Now the last step is add image. So in order to add the image, this is what people are going to click on. We're going to go ahead and open up a new tab and then in there you're going to go to Google. You're going to type in donation button PNG Twitch. Those are just the words that I find best uh, donation buttons. And since we are on phone, uh, for some reason it doesn't always work as a transparent background. So the little checker boxes will show up. But if you are on a PC or a laptop, then if you see the little checker boxes, it is transparent and those will not show up. So you have a little bit more options for the mobile. However, you may have to choose something that's a little bit smaller and a little bit more square. And I will show you why in a second. So we're going to pick one that we do like. Uh, we'll go ahead and give this one a click. Hold down on the image and then press add to photos. You do not want to save the photos from the list like this because it will make the uh, the pictures very small and it looks very tacky. And then these are all the photos that I have downloaded that I can possibly try for my donation button. So we're just going to go ahead and give one a click. And as you can see, it has a little square box right there, but it does not cover up the entire donation button. So just tap anywhere, that's okay. And then we will zoom out just a bit, tap, and then you got to drag. It takes a second to get it. A little bit of perfecting it. Boom. I think that's as good as I'm going to get this one. We're going to go ahead and press done. And then you're going to press submit. Now that it is done, we are going to go ahead and recheck this panel. And boom, we are done. There is now a edit uh, a donation button on my Twitch account. So when I click on this donation button, it will automatically reroute me to Streamlabs. And here, it will allow you to type in your username and then put in five or $10, or whatever you wanna put. And then you can also type in your donation message. And then you can also put your GIFs or GIFs or whatever you wanted to put. And you, you know the basics of donations, but this is where everything happens. So if you are familiar with donating to anyone, then you know this should look pretty familiar to you. Then you're gonna go ahead and press donate or whatever. And and then now it says donate with PayPal. So unfortunately, I'm not going to donate because uh, I'm poor. So that is pretty much it. And we now have a donation button set up on our Twitch account using just a cell phone. So you do not need to use a computer or a laptop or a tablet or anything in order to set up a donation button. Of course, it doesn't look as nice as it could if you were using a PC or something like that, because those ones you can use transparent background images and they do have a lot more options for those. If you guys do have any questions, please let me know down in the comment section. And until next time, I will see you in the next video. Also, good luck on your channel. Good luck on your donations. I really do hope that you become rich and famous and you are able to buy everything that you ever wanted. Until next time, I will see you in the next video. A21 Aaron is out. Peace out. Deuces. A21.